welcome back to Dub Gaming Entertainment. Now, as you can tell, the intro wasn't working in the past few videos, but it's been about four days since I've done my last on on the advanced guide for Moira. So we 100% finished with Moira. Moira is done on the channel. In today's video, I'll be bringing you guys the advanced guide for Diva. This video will consist on tips that help you master Diva's ultimate. Um, show you uh, what D.Va is good for, your position as a D.Va, your role, and a few counters. So guys, let's get into it. We are going to start off this Overwatch guide with your counters. So as D.Va, your biggest counter has got to be Reaper. Reaper is a massive counter to D.Va, even though D.Va is a DPS shredding tank. She can very... She can make uh, tanks very. She can make it very hard for tanks to do their job. Um, Diva's uh, moves help her to really get away from battle. Is using her def defense matrix quite oftenly and her rocket boost. Diva is incredible, and a, the general um, tip for Diva and thing that you may not have known is that she does have unlimited ammo when she's in her mech. So Diva is the only tank in this game that has a double life. I mean that is when she gets killed out of her tank form, she is she gets launched back into um, a normal DPS build um, with 150 health and a pistol that's semi-automatic. So this is a very useful thing for Diva. She's basic. She has two lives, um, and you really got to remember that as a Diva player. Um, using that with D.Va will really save you in the long run and will make your D.Va play playing so much more efficient and effective um, playing as D.Va in the game. So D.Va is basically is kind of like a tank version of Reaper. She does her the most damage that she can when she is right up in the enemy's face. That's something that you have to know when playing D.Va. You do your most damage when you're right up in your enemy's face and shooting at them. So D.Va's defense matrix is also a very useful thing in the game. I'd have to say that her defense matrix is pretty much almost as useful as Brigitte, is more useful I should say now, than Brigitte's shield. Since Brigitte has taken all of her heavy nerfs, Brigitte's shield is not as good, nowhere near as good as it used to be, um, and pretty much making um, Diva's defense matrix a much better source. So please remember that guys. Now as playing Diva I have or er, playing other heroes that I have solo killed Diva is Moira and Reaper. Those are the two heroes that I have solo killed an enemy Diva with. Not saying that you can just um, take Diva and just destroy all those characters or if anyone can just destroy you um, with those heroes is probably going to take some time because I am pretty almost a pro at both of those heroes. I'm a very good Reaper and I am a very good Moira. However, like I said, um, D.Va being a tank variant of Reaper. Now, D.Va's ultimate. The best way to use this is to fly your mecha up in the air so the enemies may not see it coming and then you just nerf and destroy them. That is, I have to think, the best um, thing to do. So like I, you just saw, that Moira wasn't enough for my D.Va. I was able to take them out as D.Va. Yet not everybody could. Um, normal D.Vas might not be able to um, beat like me as Moira or Reaper. And I'm not bragging. I'm not one for tooting my own horn. I'm just saying that um, for the facts. That not everybody is always instantly going to be able to take me out as D.Va. Okay. And D.Va, even though she's like very strong, she's not invincible. Alright, she can be killed. Remember that. A lot of people think as D.Va you can just walk right into a Reaper and an and an Auting Soldier and whatnot. And just demolish them and use all your guns. Go in there, guns are blazing. That is not the case, okay? It's actually far from the case. 
That is not what Deep is used for. And I highly recommend that you do not use that. However, D.Va is still an effective hero in the game, and I would 100% recommend that you guys play her. So that is pretty much all of the information that we have for D.Va. Uh, D.Va, just make sure you use her um, effectively. Don't use her stupid and just go out there and get yourself killed. I think D.Va's main purpose and main use in Overwatch is for when you guys um, just need to shred um, apart the DPS's of the enemy team. If the enemies are shredding you at DPS form, that's when it's time to pull a D.Va and use her effectively. Because D.Va is not like most tanks. Most tanks you know, like Reinhardt, like Sigma, and Aretha, they have shields. Um, two of the shield, one of the shields is portable, which is Ryan's. He can walk around with it. And one of the shields can be added anywhere in the map and taken back away instantly. That's Sigma. And one just stays out there until another one recharges and doesn't move until you either spawn a new one or it breaks. And that's Aresis. But D.Va's defense matrix um, is different than most. All the other shields in the game, Moira's orb will go right through them. D.Va's defense matrix will eat Moira's orb and therefore just making it disappear. That's a very useful thing for D.Va. She can just eat Moira's orbs. So making D.Va pretty much a counter to um, Moira. So you may be saying, well, if D.Va is a counter to Moira, then why did you say that uh, you've, been, you've solo killed a D.Va as Moira? Well, that's because obviously the other D.Va must not have been knowing what they're supposed to be doing. And that's really the honest opinion. It comes down to skill and knowledge. You gotta know how to play D.Va in order to destroy the other team with her. It's really that simple. D.Va's defense matrix is possibly the, is the most useful shit in the game. But it is not useful if you don't know how to use it. You gotta know how to use D.Va's defense matrix in order to just demolish an entire team with it. And that's the bottom line. D.Va's defense matrix eats enemies prototypes up eats um orbs and it eats tons of other things and that's pretty much the bottom line thank you guys so much for watching this video if you guys did go to enjoy make sure you pop a like comment and subscribe to dub gaming entertainment your support is 110 percent greatly appreciated here at dub gaming entertainment and if you guys didn't see the rest of my uh, overwatch guys make sure you check it out um, on my Overwatch Guides playlist. Also check out my other 300 Overwatch videos I have posted on Dub Game Entertainment. Thank you guys for watching. Turn on the bell notifications so you don't miss out on the exclusive content that I post here at Dub Game Entertainment. And as always, keep safe and I will see you guys in the next Overwatch video.